Hey folks, welcome back to another exciting episode of Adventures in Dog Training with American Standard Dog Training and DIYK9.com and... Patty Mayo. Patty Mayo TV, baby. So he's come out here with uh, his protection trained uh, dog, Kobos. And today we're gonna do some obedience. We're gonna do some control work. We're gonna do some bite work. We're also gonna train him up and start training him up on laser training so that Patty can send his dog anywhere uh, to catch these bad guys. The first so, thing I wanna do is put one ply toilet paper around your neck and take a bite. One piece of to uh, newspaper, and then let's try that bite. <laughs> now stay tuned to the end because we have a special announcement where we're gonna do something close to what Patty talked about. Uh, at the end, we'll explain to you what it is. So get ready for this episode. Are you interested in buying any Girl Scout cookies today, sir? I'm selling Girl Scout cookies for my Girl Scout. <laughs> Only the Thin Mints. What's up, baby? This is a pretty serious dog uh, for the folks at home. This is no joke, KMPV dog, uh, real serious. And he's kicking up my grass because he thinks he owns the place already. What'd you find? A port! I gotta get myself one of those. He loves oh, that yeah, thing. Man. Yeah. Well, let's uh, start like we should with obedience anyways. Okay. Make sure that's looking sharp. I'm gonna wait for the tug toy. It's a wonderful way to reward him. When you're happy with what he does, we're gonna mark that behavior with a verbal marker say yes and deliver the food. I don't, I, or the toy. We have to have a way of letting them know when we're really happy with something. Yes! Good boy. Good boy, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dumb prof, yeah. Los! Tell him why yes. Yes! Good boy. Los! Why yes? Yes! Fui! Los! Fui! When you say fooey, that means don't touch it. Not this like, maybe I can get a little bite. Stop it. What I mean, he's listening to you, but it's not like sharp. Right. You say fooey, you have to say it a few times. You'll say heel, you gotta say it a few times. <laughs> Every time you give your dog a command, they come to a crossroad. Down this path, potentially, is the tug. Down this path, is potentially the tug. Every time we give him a command, we want every dog to always go right, the right way, the right path, what dad told you to do. On the left here, which is supposed to be blocked off, barricades, barbed wire, broken glass, you name it. This is impassable. If dad says Vulligan, I don't give a if the toys over here, you cannot go through there. The more he goes through, next thing you know, both paths are open. And so when you give him a command, he's like, well, I could either listen and there's a maybe, but this is a short thing. It's right there, I'm looking at it. I need him to know this shit is closed. There sure as is no toy at the end. That toy that's sitting there, you have it other outside of when I say you can have it, that will bite you back. Once he understands going left is always a loss, he'll stop going left, man, he'll only go right. And when he goes right, he gets paid. So it's a win-win. What he needs right now is to know that he can't go left. Yeah, it's no or else. This is what I want you to work on is building this up. Okay. There's plenty of reward. You're gonna reward the shit out of it. All right, so we're just doing some obedience training. We wanna make sure that we keep Kobos tight. This goes with any dog. I don't care what level of training your dog has. You need constant maintenance to keep them tight. So that's what we're doing now. We're gonna tighten up his healing just a little bit and a little bit of that impulse control. Super jacked for this toy, but he has to learn there's a time to play with the toy, there's a time to leave the toy alone. I want you to heal around okay. this. If he does what he's supposed to, he gets paid. This is the, the true use of obedience. We need him to be obedient even when he wants to bite something. Walk right over that thing. Oh, that's nice. Now when you're ready, you can say, why yes? Yes! Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. See, so he gets rewarded and then play with him. Work him, have fun with him. Left, right, think of like a, like a circle eight. Up and down, left and right, and then go static for a minute, see if he'll punch in. You can tell him, Fasta. Fasta. Yeah, that's good boy. And when he does that, you can let go. Yeah, good boy. That's his win. Now he's like, oh, play with me, play with me. Because this is not just the toy, it's the whole game of tug. Yeah. Watch your thumbs and everything and tell him, Fasta. Fasta. Ah, that's good boy. Fasta. And we praise him. Oh, it's a good, good boy. boy. And work him left to good right. Boy. And then now listen to me. Hold it tight, because you're going to tell him to let go of it. Close. Close. That's it. Lights on, lights off. We're okay. playing, we're not playing. The game of healing is to pay attention to what I'm doing. He feels the pressure. He goes, ah, what the f 
And what does he see? He sees me way back here, even moving backwards. Ah, see? He goes, wait, I gotta stay with this See, so he's looking at me, bulligan. He does a little bit of a wrap around, which is fine. So it's more of a dance, healing's a dance. When I stop, he gotta, he's gotta stop like a dime, baby. He cannot pass my toes. If he does, he feels pressure. The pressure's pretty clear though, because it's, ow, what? Oh, you stopped, that's right. Yes! Good boy, Woo, it's a good boy. Los! That, oh, that was so much cleaner. Yeah. Yes! Good boy. Woo, it's my propia. Los! Knee biting, foo wee. Foo wee. Yes! Ah, it's a propia. Good boy, you got no loyalty. That's your daddy over there. It's like going to the, it's like going to the car wash. Yes, <laughs> we're cleaning them up. <laughs> Good boy. I right, take them home, it gets a little dirty. Yeah. You gotta bring them back to the car wash, it's, add a little detail, a little so spit true. shine. You know, like things that, that, I, that I don't see falling through the crack or, or going sloppy. You can see that yep. sloppy or like where they're at. Routines are great, but with dogs, we have to have variations within the routine. With the out. Sometimes he gets the toy back one second later, sometimes 30 seconds later, sometimes never. Little variation on it. If it's always out and you take it from me, out and you take it from me, it's like, bro, the guy's just gonna take it from me. Yeah. What if there's hope? Or he might, he might let me get it again, man. Let me, let me see, let me spit it really quick and see what happens. Oh, oh, he gave it to me. Always keep them thinking because they're so smart that they'll get in these uh, routines and habits. They'll see the patterns. Yeah, we need to have the variation. The, the only true pattern is listen to dad. He'll tell you what he wants done. Heel. Down. Uh-uh. Laser. Soup. Yes. Now, it's been a minute since we worked it, but I can laser him and then down him with a vibrate. Good boy. So now you can send him where you want, drop him, Send them again, drop them. Suk. Yes. Suk. So they have to trust the laser. Tr the laser always on that board, always brings them to the promised land. Let's see how this goes. Laser. Suk. I'm gonna down them. Laser. Yes. That's nice. Now I think one of his issues is gonna be, he's gonna Close. He's gonna take off. <laughs> <laughs> I want him to always know to look straight to the ground for it follow and it. follow it out. See that? That's beautiful. It's like, look, ball, look, ball. Got it. Right there. Yes, beautiful, beautiful. Very nice. Look at the ground. There, there it is, there it is. Good job, good job. Oh, wasn't that a clean rep? That was pretty. All right, so we're gonna do some control work with Kobos, meaning you're allowed to bite, but only when daddy says so. Well, like Other it. than that, if I tell you to heal, you better heal like a champ. I don't care how distracting the guy, the tasty, juicy guy in the suit is. Go to a down, off. See, it's not fast enough, right? Go off. That was, that was nice. Send him. Ah. Yeah. Good, right on the elbow, how's that feel? <laughs> Lost. That's what he's supposed to do, okay? Oh, Very nice. Now, see how clean that Voligan was? Yeah. You could almost send him. Not, it's the moment passed, but you could send him again. If he does something that you really like, like that, bang, like you get paid that. right. But we're not gonna always do that because then he's gonna start to rebite all the time. Every once in a while, we throw him a little bone. Stop it. Yes. Put your hands up above your head. There you go. Yes. I'm gonna pat you down. And now I'm gonna have your guy attack me, is that okay? Yeah. Okay, go to attack me. There it is. Good job. Take off running and send him. Take off running, send him. Stella! Get ready. You're gonna hit hard. <laughs> you gotta learn how to catch, player. Good boy. Never give your back to your dog, okay? Like, don't put yourself between him. Life. Stella! Work him, work him, work him. You don't have to grab him unless you want to pet him. There you go. Keep working him. You can praise him up, Patty. 
You want to try another straight without falling? <laughs> See, no commands needed. Now, ultimately what he's looking for is to rip this off of my boy here. Yeah, just let him enjoy this. This is a tug toy now. Fasta. Fasta. Oh, so good boy. <laughs> Get your arm out. Always have this problem. Good boy, huh? Okay. He's a superstar like Seth. Yeah! This is a tuck toy now. Yeah, good just boy. watch your finger. <laughs> good boy. Los! Good boy! All right, folks, that wraps it up. Now, if you stay tuned like we told you to, here you are. Now, we're here's a special announcement. On the next episode, I'm gonna take a bite from Patty Mayo's K and PV trained Belgian Malinois, who bites hard as <laughs> And I'm gonna take a bite on pigskin leather. If we get even more likes, I'll do it on deerskin leather. He'll break your wrist on that one. Probably. I think he's gonna, you could crush your bone. He could <laughs> fracture your uh, wrist for sure. It's worth the risk, baby. Or if we guys really blow it out of the park, I'll do a bite from his dog on newspaper. No single ply toilet On his paper. ass. Uh, <laughs> this is my money maker. This is my second money maker, baby. So we can't be around with my ass. There's, but, an, there's <laughs> an American can standard canine only fans. <laughs> we should start with, <laughs> if you, if you want to see this happen, post in the comments, like, share, subscribe and we'll see you on in the, the next, next video. One.